pale, a little bit hot and sweaty. It is so hot today. Wow. There's Ray. Say hello. Oh, my current situation. Um, I hope uh, you guys had a great Monday yesterday and wanted to come and just chat with you a little bit about I wanted you to do an exercise today visualizing what would your life look like if you had no payments. So obviously the Dave Ramsey plan, the whole point is to get out of debt, then you build your emergency fund, then you save up for your house if you want to buy it or you hadn't bought a house yet, and then you do baby step four, five, and six, which is 15% to retirement, uh, about 5% usually is to college fund if you have children, and the rest you throw to the house. But what would it life be like if you had no home payment, no car payment, no credit card payments, no student loan payments? Like, you'd have money. How much money would you have? You should calculate that. If you're renting, you know, calculate the rent. All you have to do is pay taxes and insurance. Be much less than a mortgage, right? And a, and a rent. So calculate your rent. Calculate the payments that you pay on all your credit cards and on your student loan and everything. And say, bam, I'd have like three grand a month that I don't have right now. Because, yes, it takes time to get there. But the point is, I just wanted you to take a second just to think about just to think about what would your life look like if you made even your current money with no payments you'd be in a much different position than you are now obviously you can make more money all the above but your life would be totally different so i'll tell you our situation we would uh save on payments because we've already killed the car and some debts previously we only have two credit cards that we still owe on under your girl's name uh, one student loan and then we have some other uh, business debt that we owe but we don't have payments on those um, that we have to settle and figure out but just payments wise so we have a, quite a bit of debt but just payments wise we would save 525 plus I think it's three something almost 400 bucks so 925 about so 900 bucks a month we would save if we had no debt no debt at all minus our house and then, you know, let's say a $2,500 mortgage, $2,500 plus $900, almost $3,500 a month, we'd have extra. We don't have a $2,500 mortgage. I was just giving you an example based on, um, you know, what we may buy. But that's the whole point. So what would your life look like if you had no debt, no payments, and your house was paid off? You'd have money. So let's say it's 3500 bucks a month for me. That's 35 That is. Let's calculate it. 36000 a year plus six more thousand. 42 Gs. 42 Gs. Okay, minus taxes and insurance and everything. Okay, let's say it's 32 Gs. So say that's 10 grand. 32 Gs. What can I do with 32 Gs? I could take a nice vacation. That's for sure. I could invest more. I can give more. I mean, hello. Talk about living life without limits. And it's so attainable for everybody. I was just talking to a friend of mine who drives for trucks for UPS. And I'm like, get on the Dave Ramsey plan. Get on the Dave Ramsey plan. Get on the Dave Ramsey plan. Because uh, as I've told you before, when they did the, the interview of all the millionaires who retired as millionaires, a third of them never saw a six-figure income in their household. That's two people working, one person working, and the other person stays at home with their kids. But in a household where, with two incomes, uh, they never saw beyond a hundred grand. They never saw six figures in one single working year of the whole working history. Yet they retired with a net worth of a million plus dollars between a paid for house and between uh, all their investments into retirement over time compounding interest putting 15 percent of your income month after month for years and years and years and years and years anyway that's anybody any it's attainable for anybody you know they say i think the top which i forgot to tell my friend this the top positions that retire as millionaires I think one of them is engineer, 
Uh, and the other one is teachers. Teachers. When do you hear? And sure, should teachers be paid more? Probably yes. I don't even know all the inner workings of that world. But when do you hear that teachers get paid enough to retire as millionaires? But it's about what you do with your money and how intentional you are in the decisions you make and the opportunity cost of buying these purse versus you know investing that money or going on the vacation versus investing that money or worse going on vacation or going to disney when you got debt when you got student loans right so anyway just wanted to say think about it put it in your head what would your life look like if you had no payments no payments not one payment was coming out from credit card student loans a car not one payment and your house your housing bro that's that's having money that's building wealth and i don't know about you but that's why i'm on the dave ramsey plan that's why i'm doing what he says because he knows more than i do and i am on my game because that's where i'm planning to be you know we will be debt free by the end of this year and so we will be saving that 900 dollars a month and then um we'll save up we're gonna buy a house and the average payoff is seven years the average people who do the dave ramsey plan pay off their house in seven years of course i want to break that average probably three four year payoff go go ham uh, on paying off the house but anyway just wanted you to just think about it you know you have to come up with a good why to decide to do the sacrifice and to change your life do you want to retire a millionaire sounds good to me do you want to live along the way you can do a lot more, a lot more vacations, a lot more everything if you have no payments. All right, bye.